Hello random people on the internet, my name is Banana, and today I want to talk to you guys about something that has been combing the back of my brain for a bit, and that is the Divin's Drill, or Divon's Drill, or however you say Divin. I've said Divin the entire time, so I'm just gonna keep saying that, but we're gonna talk about the coming soon Divine Rarity Drill that, uh honestly isn't even that good and i want to get into a conversation about this drill if it should be good how it's not good and what that means for the people who actually own it so let's just get right into it now i don't actually have a divins drill i have a 655 and that is because the divins drill is <laughs> it's so many coins it costs like two billion ish coins to get a divins drill in the modern day and it cost even more back before we knew that gemstones were getting nerfed and that there were actually some uh different changes coming to the divins drill that make it worse than it already is so to really look at the Divins Drill, we have to compare the difference between the Divins Drill and the 655 right now. So we're going to look at the Gemstone Grinder just to see the stats. If we go into here, you can see the Divins Drill, 1800 speed, 150 fortune. If we go and find the 655, 1600 speed and 120 fortune. So it has 200 speed more and 30 fortune more on the Divins Drill. And the 30 fortune by itself isn't terrible. The speed's not really that necessary, but it's also uh, okay. And it also has a rarity above the Titanium Drill. The Titanium Drill's legendary, Divins Drill is mythic. And the most important difference between these drills as of the current moment in the game is the gemstone slots that it has because the Divins Drill has Jade, Amber, and Topaz. And if you look at the 655, the 655 only has Jade and Amber. That extra topaz slot coupled with the extra fortune you get from the drill adds so much money per hour to anyone who has bought the Divins drill. And that's why it was worth it for a lot of people to spend multiple billions of coins to just buy the alloy because the alloy is one of the rarest. It might even be the rarest item in the game when it comes to just the method of obtaining it and how <laughs> insanely difficult it is to get it to drop. But that thing is so rare and people were dropping upwards of 3 billion coins sometimes to get the drill because the topaz slot was amazing but in the next update in the gemstone nerfs that are coming out they're changing around a bunch of the slots the divins drill is gaining two slots it is gaining an amber slot and a jade slot on top of the ones that it already has but the 655 is also gaining a topaz slot. So when you look at it, it's uh, the difference between the drills is getting less and less. Obviously, there is going to be a good amount of fortune more on the Divins drill. It's going to have like 80 more fortune than the 655 has. But 80 fortune uh, is definitely not as worth purchasing for billions and billions of coins as something like a topaz slot. Now the admins recognized that the Divins drill was getting worse, so they are trying to alleviate the worseness of it by adding a new rarity specific to the Divins drill and any items on its caliber in the future, and that rarity is called Divine. Divine is the same color as MVP plus and MVP by the way, so anyone who guessed a light blue for the color of Divine, you would be correct. But Divine buffs Reforge stats, and we don't know how hard it is going to buff Reforge stats, but I just want to mention something about mining Reforges, and that is that every single Drill Reforge sucks. So them adding this new rarity is cool and all, and it will give more stats to a Divins Drill over something like a 655, but Every single mining reforge gives pretty much nothing of use when it comes to stats. When you look at the main reforge that everyone runs, which is Auspicious. Auspicious gives 60 speed and it has a bonus which grants 8 mining fortune which increases chance for multiple drops. Obviously, you guys know what mining fortune does. 
but that mining fortune is unaffected by rarity. No matter what rarity you have, you're going to get eight mining fortune, and uh, that's just how it's gonna work. The speed is affected by rarity, but 60 mining speed is literally nothing when you have people pushing, like how much speed do I even get? I don't have anywhere near max speed, and if I hold out that, I get 6,545. So 60 mining speed, grand scheme, absolute dirt here. It's 1% of my speed. It's affecting pretty much nothing. And adding a little bit more to that is not going to make the Divins Drill actually worth it. So for anyone who is grinding gemstones and wanting to be the best of the best, obviously the Divins Drill is still going to be the number one drill for you to go for. It's still going to be the best item in the game for mining, but it's going to be marginally better at best because the fortune on it is the only thing that's really better. The pristine is getting changed to be the exact same as a 655. And I would expect to see the Divins Drill drop in value by... It, it'll probably be under a billion coins at least. I think that it will be somewhere... I, I can't really judge how expensive it'll be right now because we don't know how rare it's going to be from Nucleus with the new changes. But I just know for sure that it's going to drop in value because of the 655 getting so much better. I really do wish, even as a 655 user myself, even as someone who is getting buffed pretty well in the update, I wish that they would not have added the Topaz slot to 655. That is just very, very good. It's very... Uh, just it's so good for them to just throw it on there and I don't get why they wouldn't just keep it on the Divins drill because this item was already just like very questionable of a purchase just because you can already make so much money without it and if you're dumping multiple billions and billions of coins on some item that isn't even that amazing what's the point and now it's even more not amazing so I just am a bit worried for the future of gemstone mining and Divins drill prices. Another thing that they could do to fix this, I guess, is to make better mining reforges. Something like the refined amber, which or the amber material right here, which gives the ambered reforge. If they just buffed this reforge to give fortune as a base stat, I don't even care how much, just make a reforge that actually gives good stats for mining. If they did that, that would make the Divins Drill much more worth it because we're going to have unique Reforge stats on Divine and it's going to be a substantial difference if they add a good stat into any Mining Reforge. But as of right now, every single Mining Reforge that I can think of only gives Mining Speed. So Mining Speed is not going to be something that is going to be absurdly changed, especially if you have a Divins Drill. Because if you have a Divins Drill, you better be a bit into your heart of the mountain tree you better have a good setup other than just the drill and no one needs speed so if they just made the ambered reforge better and they made it give fortune of some kind maybe just maybe you could justify having divin's drill be a thing that you get that's pretty much all I wanted to say on the Divins Drill. Leave a comment down below if you guys have any thoughts on the Divins Drill and the 655. I definitely think it is a pretty interesting change, and uh, it definitely does suck for all the people who bought Divins Drills for like 3 billion coins, but they probably made those coins back. I hope you enjoyed the video. Hope it kept you informed, and I will talk to you guys in the next one. Peace out.